name is Ana Araújo and I am answering for Global Communications. My first, first question is my name. My name is Ana Carolina Gomes Araújo, but I go by Ana Araújo. What do you do for fun? I love TV shows. I am crazy about TV shows. I can sit on my couch and watch TV shows the entire day. Uh, I'm currently watching Breaking Bad, Mad Men, Game of Thrones. I'm catching up on Orange the New Black. I'm re-watching Community. I love that show. So I just love it. And besides that, I'm more like meeting up with my friends, especially in their houses. And I'm very much calm and yeah, very like calm and like simple things. Just more like having a drink with my friend and talking staying at home with the boyfriend and things like that. What culture do you identify with and why? I love this go get it culture in the USA. It's just like if you like it you just go for it, you know, and it's just this just go get it idea. I think it's awesome. I love the Brazilian train of thought like more family oriented. I love how we are nosy with each other, but we don't really care. We don't see is in a is we don't see as a bad thing. If you're my friend or if you are my family, your problems are my problems as well. Everything is ours, and we just get in each other's business, and it's normal. We don't feel bad about that, or we don't get mad about that. That's it's just how we are, and I think that's awesome. One thing you like about your culture and why? I love how Brazilians link music with their lives. We are so rich, like our music scene is so rich and we acknowledge that and it's like we create soundtracks for every single thing in our lives and I think that's awesome. We have like themes, music themes for literally everything and music that remind us of breakup or getting together or a boyfriend or a party and we love it and we do it all the time in a natural way and I think that's in our blood in a such way that it's, it's just beautiful. If you could change something about your culture, what would be? I think Brazilians are way too pacifist. We are like Oh, we don't like it, but that's how it is. Oh, well, that's just how it is. Just go with it. And I think it's changing, but I think there is a long way to go yet. We are way too, like, compromised. We are way too, okay, just, that's just how it is. And I think, I think that's a shame. I think we should defend ourselves. We have such a rich and beautiful culture, and we just don't really fight for it, you know? I think we really should fight for it more. Do you like talking to strangers and why? I do. I think I am curious. But I think I was born curious. I that's why I did journalism, I believe, because I, I was just interested in stories. And I'm I've been working as a bartender for the past two years and I have customers that they come over and they show me like the pictures of their grandkids and they tell me about them and their kids' wedding and the kids going away from college. And you see how everybody faces life in different ways and how everybody sees things in different ways and I think that's just awesome to watch. And it's like people from really different backgrounds they just come and you have no idea where they come from and what they're doing and when you figure out that you see how amazing those people's stories are and you had no idea of knowing by looking by them. So I think it's just, you just see how we have so many different stories and so different life styles that we can learn with and it's just, I just love seeing that. How would you get a stranger to talk to you? I think if you just show that you are, you are really willing to listen. I think everybody likes to talk. Like, Everybody likes to show their point of view. I think it's just part of the human being. And I think when you find someone that actually wants to listen to you and you feel like that person is willing to listen to you, the people talk. 
you know, and if, if you ask them about anything and you show that you're not judging them, you just you just want to learn and listen. They talk, people talk, so I think it's, it's natural. People like to talk. Okay, I'm Portuguese. One thing you usually don't like new people to know about you and why. Essa é uma pergunta muito difícil. Eu acho, eu não gosto quando pessoas me julgam insegura ou eu tenho medo de, de suar burra. Eu tenho medo que as pessoas me achem burra. Então, talvez eu tenha, eu acho que eu tenho um problema com se eu me sentir sendo diminuída. Então, eu acho new people know about me. Eu acho que se as pessoas verem a minha inseguridade, eu poderia pôr desse jeito. Ver que eu tenho medo de falhar, ou medo de ser burra, ou... Acho que nesse sentido, eu acho que, que faz eu me sentir menor. Eu acho que é um jeito bom de colocar isso. Não sei, acho que eu... Ah, espero que você tenha entendido. Um, when I was trying to explain a phrase, oh yeah, um, saudade é uma coisa muito difícil de explicar, porque não é só que você está sentindo falta, mas você tem um carinho especial por isso. E eu acho que é uma ideia muito difícil de transmitir. E sarcasmo. Quando você fala com sarcasmo, eu acho que o sarcasmo brasileiro não é muito parecido com o sarcasmo americano. E eles levam muito a sério. E eu tive que aprender isso, que né, você nem sempre pode agir com sarcasmo, porque eles vão achar que você tá falando sério. Em vez de você só tá brincando. E eu acho que é isso. I hope you all liked it. And I'm sorry for the low quality, but I'm shooting at work on my cell phone. Uh, thank you very much for the opportunity. I'm looking forward to meet you all and work with this project. Thank you very much. Bye-bye.